Dubinov was not useful to Russia, but in vain. In figure skating, a new European champion from Georgia. Kochevgeny Rukovitsin commented on the victory of his student in Ispu. I have one emotion. I'm just very happy. So right, said Rukovitsin. We cannot but rejoice at the news that our figure skater won gold at the European Championships. I worked with Nasir for several years, of course, I am happy for Grubanova. I know that I contributed to her development as a technical and gifted athlete. I congratulate her from the bottom of my heart, this is a great success. Miss Yuha really won the victory. The strongest always wins. To date, Anastasia has rightfully earned the title of European Champion, said Olympic Champion Alexei Ermanov. Congratulations Nastya. This is a Russian school, it is visible. And she far surpasses everyone. This is the first victory of a Georgian girl. I heartily congratulate Nastya and the Georgian leadership. She was at the right time, at the right time. I use my moment, and this is not given to everyone. Luna Hendricks also went to first place, all cards in hand. But Nastya won. I am very happy for her as a human being. Naturally, I will contact her, congratulations. She trained for so many years, went to this. Well done. Said figure skating coach Lena Bainova. I'm very happy for her. She is great. Congratulations to her. Of course, Russian figure skating has a great merit in its achievements. We have so many excellent athletes that in order to get to the European and World Championships, you have to change your sports citizenship in order to be at a high level. Said Olympic champion Vistemyanova. They wanted to put an end to Nastya, but she rebooted her career by changing her citizenship. A student of Evgeny Rukovitsin took gold from Ispu. At the Eurovision Championships in Ispu, something incredible is happening. Anastasia Gubanova proved that figure skating cannot exist completely without Russia. The word of Evgeny Rukovitsin won gold in Ispu and made the whole of Georgia rejoice. Alas, in Russia the figure skater was not useful, because of which she was forced to change sports citizenship. In juniors, the athletes showed excellent results and imposed the fight on Alina Zajitova herself. With the release of adults, Kubanova began to decline, but in a difficult period of her career, Nastya was left alone with her problems. The figure skater's coach Elena Bayanova did not support the student and kicked her out because of being overweight. It looks like it was a big mistake. The European Championship in Finland, even without Russian skaters, is of genuine interest to figure skating fans. Moreover, it could not have done without pupils of the Russian school at all. Most experts called Anastasia Gubanova, an ex-Russian who now represents Georgia, the favorite of the tournament. A powerful support group for Nastya was formed in Russia, in particular, Maker Ignatov and Dmitry Ali supported her. I will keep my fingers crossed for our girl, teammate Nastya Gubanova. Before the first Channel Cup, I sent her all kinds of rays of energy that I had, and I want her to use it and bring a medal. I would very much like her to perform well. Aliyev said, and his words turned out to be prophetic. At the beginning, Gubanova acquired a small gold medal of the European Championship for her collection, having won the short program. According to her, this achievement was not easy for her, it was exciting, and the status of the favorite was slightly pressing. To be honest, before the start I was very nervous, the preparation was very difficult mentally, I can't say that I was 100% ready for this tournament. But this is already my second European Championship, so I somehow found the strength to calm down. I tried to write in such a way as to have fun. She shared after the end of the performances. Nasu prepared even more carefully for the free program, because the rivals were not weak. Almost all the skaters from the strongest warm-up performed at a good level. Only Olga Mikitina from Austria failed the rental, having made three falls and rolled back to the twelfth line of the standings. Another ex-Russian Ekaterina Kurakova improved her result compared to last year. An athlete from Poland stopped a step away from the podium, while her performance was devoid of serious mistakes. 16-year-old Swiss Kimi Ripon made a lot of noise in his boo, giving an impeccable performance. Triple Lutz Triple Toe Loop, Triple Flip and Ritberger, Double Axel, Cascade of Double Flip Double Toe Loop Double Lutz, Double Axel and Triple Toe Loop Sequence and Triple Salkow, all this was performed without a single air. A sheet program to the music of Muse captivated the whole. And the judges were also impressed. 128 68 points for the free program and 192 52 in total. The skaters join knew no bounds. 
Kimmy squealed like a child and couldn't hold back her tears. How happy it was for this girl. But the experienced Belgian Luna Hendricks cried with disappointment. The athlete made two falls, because of which she lost the most important cascades. This greatly blurred the impression of her powerful production of the Black Swan. But the moon kept the image to the end, and compensated for everything with high components. As a result, her result was 125.63 points, in total 193.48. The mistakes of the competitor opened up great prospects for Gubanova, but it was necessary not to make mistakes herself. And Nastya proved that she is capable of much. She started with a great combination of triple lutz triple toe loop, added a double axle, got a little nervous on the triple loop, and kept up the pace with a great triple salkow. After this jump over the arena there was a deafening applause. The athlete deserved the love of the public, and, feeling this, went into the lead. She staggered a little on the triple flip, but then showed how to cleanly do this element in combination with a triple toe loop. The sequence with double axles and toll loop became the last loud chord in her box office. Then there was a cool step sequence and spectacular spins, and that's all it became clear that in figure skating, there was a new European champion from Georgia. Her scores only confirmed this 130-10 for a free program and 199-91 in total. Nasty was crying, her choreographer Valentin Molotov rolled his eyes in a funny way, very worried about the ward, and somewhere in St. Petersburg, the coach Evgeny Rukovitsin was celebrating the victory. Gubanova's victory proves that world figure skating cannot exist without Russians, although Nasty was not useful to Russia. As time has shown, in vain. The athletes showed promise in juniors. For example, in the debut final of the Grand Prix in the 2016-2017 season, Gubanova lost only to Lina Zagitova. Everyone expected that with the release of adult results, the figure skater would only increase, but suddenly she began to decline. Work with an experienced specialist Elena Bayanova did not help either. Nasir failed to gain a foothold in the national team, which is why it was impossible to count on getting into international competitions. The situation was aggravated by a conflict with the mentor, who was frankly dissatisfied with the results of the ward. In the summer of 2019, the athlete was expelled from CSK for the discrepancy between the current sports form and the task set. Bayanova spoke openly about Gubanova's problems with being overweight, noting that the figure skater was not training hard enough. Nasya herself admitted that she really was not in optimal shape, but the cause was unhealed injuries. As a result, she had to change the group and go to Evgeny Rukovitsin. But even with the new coach Gubanova, it was hard to break into the elite, the competition in Russian figure skating was too great, and then Nastya decided to compete under a different flag. It could have been Belarus, but the skater made a choice in favor of Georgia. In his composition, the skater got to all the main starts, last season she became the 7th at the European Championships, the 6th at the World Championships and the 11th at the Olympics. And now she won the gold of the European Championship. The tale of Anastasia Gubanova definitely continues. Let's follow her progress.